Okay, so what you have in front of you right here, um, this is my setup as far as when I do uh, stereo recording, um, mainly for outside, whether I'm recording nature or just regular, just ambient noise um, outside. Um, and what you have are, these are the two clippy mics. Um, also, here's the mount, they're on the mount right here. And then I have my Zoom F4, and then also um, just some other equipment that goes into my bag. And normally my Zoom F4, when I do this setup, uh, all of this right here is within my bag. But I'm just showing an, an example with the stuff outside of the bag. And also normally too, um, I, I would have the two microphones, the uh, Clippy microphones on this, on this mount right here. And this mount would be set up on a tripod or um, a light stand or something like that. Um, the one thing that I don't like about this setup is once again, like I said, first of all, I have to, uh, especially when I'm, I'm outside doing outside stereo recording, um, I have to put all this stuff in my bag. Um, and I'm looking for a smaller imprint as far as my workflow. Um, so Zoom just recently announced its Zoom um, Essential series, which is the Zoom H1 Essential, which is a two track. And then you have the Zoom H4 Essential, which is a four track recorder. And then they also have the Zoom H6 Essential, which is a six track recorder. Um, the one that I'm really interested in uh, is the Zoom H4 Essential. Um, and it's, it's a very uh, small recorder. Well, it's not very small, but it's smaller than the F4 and uh, the H4. And the H stands for handheld. Um, I actually had the very first Zoom H, uh, H4 back in the day when it first came out. And it was, it was, a, great, um, it was a great recorder. So... Uh, when Zoom announced that they're coming out with the Essential series, um, it, it really, um, I really said, man, let me look into this as far as this setup is concerned. Um, one thing too about uh, the, the Essential series that's coming out um, is that all of them will be able to record in 32-bit float. And, uh, you know, everybody talks about 32-bit float these days. Um, and I think 32 bit bit float, especially when you're doing uh, like outside recording, when you need to record for uh, long periods of time, uh, will be great for this particular setup. So, yeah. So, um, like I said, um, I'm looking to maybe purchase uh, the Zoom H4 Essential uh, when it comes out. I think it comes out in March. Um, I am looking at a, a number of um, a lot of YouTubers or a, a few YouTubers actually have been testing these uh, essentials um, and they, they've been giving their opinions on them and uh, what they think of them so far. You know, I'm seeing some some good reviews. I'm seeing some bad reviews as well. I know one guy was was uh, uh, testing out the essentials and one thing he noticed uh, were the preamps and he was saying that the preamps were very noisy. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm going to I'm going to look at some more um, some more reviews on the essentials and then I'll make my decision whether or not to purchase it or not. But, yeah, this is just a, a quick video just to uh, talk about my setup as far as uh, with my stereo recording and also bi binary recording as well. Um, but this was a, a, a quick uh, video just uh, saying about that and also how I'm, I'm very interested in maybe getting the Zoom H4 Central. So hopefully this was informative and until next time, take care.